Almost a month after a Lake County cemetery is vandalized, detectives arrest two men following a bizarre discovery. Those graves were found destroyed. Investigators say body parts of some of the people buried were found inside a Polk County apartment. News 6's Crystal Moyer tells us about the one piece of evidence that led to the arrest. It all comes down to cigars that were left here at the scene. Detectives with the Lake County Sheriff's Office say they ran the DNA through their database and got a match, leading them to the first suspect. 43-year-old Brian Tolentino and 39-year-old Burgos Lopez are behind bars on four counts of disturbing the contents of a grave and abuse of a dead body. Investigators with the Lake County Sheriff's Office say the two men admitted to randomly breaking into graves here at the Edgewood Cemetery and taking heads and other body parts last month. It's sick. I don't know them and it breaks my heart. Mother and daughter Tanya and Emma Booth are still emotional after discovering the vandalism and calling police. It was just kind of like concrete thrown around. The bodies were exposed and dismembered. According to an arrest affidavit, investigators searched Lopez's Polk County home and found a human skull, a hand and partial arm, as well as multiple bones. They also found several human heads, one belonging to an Army veteran laid to rest here at Edgewood Cemetery. It makes me angry. I mean, they gave the ultimate sacrifice and you just gave them the ultimate disrespect. The suspects told investigators they took the body parts for religious reasons. Sickening. We were both just devastated, flabbergasted. And now relieved, the families involved will get justice. Uh, no family should ever have to go through something like this. Once you, once you put your loved one at rest, that should be it. Both suspects are booked into the Polk County Jail and could be facing additional charges. In Mount Dora, Crystal Moyer, Getting Results, News 6.